Hey gang, what's going on? So I'm gonna put out a series of videos of commits to each school. Uh, it's not gonna be every commit, it's gonna be the top five for each school. So um, this week will be the Florida State Seminoles. Uh, we will also be putting uh, their transfers as well if, uh, when I get a chance to find those as well. But before I do that, uh, if you could hit that like, subscribe, and bell icon buttons, it's greatly appreciated. It's extremely helpful for the channel. It gives me great feedback on what you think, as well as I don't want you to miss out on a single thing that I put out. So let's get into it. Starting with Florida State. So Florida State had a huge commitment from one of the top players in the country. Um, it's five-star plus safety. KJ Bolden uh, from Buford, Georgia. He has made that a hard commitment and he made that commitment on August 5th of this year. So he will be joining the Seminoles as uh, a five-star plus. So that's a great, great sign for them and that's a great commit for them. Uh, to follow him, we have five-star cornerback Charles Luster III. He is also a hard commit. He committed on July 28th of this year. Another fantastic uh, recruiting uh, recruit for them. Uh, he'll be great. He's one of the, the top cornerbacks in the country. And he is out of Venice, Florida. Then we've got... A four-star tight end, Landon Thomas. He was a hard commit on April 17th of this year. So that's going to be good. Give uh, Get a good offensive player for them. So good job on their part. Then they've got uh, Luke Cor uh, Croman Hoke, who is from Savannah, Georgia. Now Landon Thomas is from Colquitt County. Our uh, Moultrie, Georgia, I think it's pronounced, but he is from Georgia as well. So Luke Cromhook uh, is from Savannah, Georgia. He is a four-star hard commit as well. He committed on March 26, 2022. So he was, uh, he is with the, them now, but uh, we're not going to go too much further into them. But Landon Thomas, Charles Lester III, and K.J. Bolden are all huge commits for them. It gives them a good tight end. It gives them two of the top defensive kids in the country, and it really helps them out. So good job on the recruiting part for Florida State. And it's really going to be a fantastic – it's going to be fantastic to see how they – uh, end up doing so for the transfer side of things where they are um, getting kids who are transferring from other schools which does happen uh, Florida State actually got a couple of guys uh, one who is currently playing with them now and I'm not sure the other one is but uh, three-star linebacker Justin Cryer went from Northwestern to Florida State, while um, Keon Coleman, who was a Michigan State Spartan, left and is playing with Florida State. So, two nice pickups, and Keon Coleman is actually showing why he has been a very, very nice pickup for them. So, good job for Florida State on picking him up. Uh, I will go into other teams. The next team I will be doing will be uh, Michigan. Uh, let me know what you guys think, and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great rest of your night.